it's Wednesday um, and I am heading to London. Uh, yeah, I've just dropped Arthur off at school. Erin is in the shop with mum and I am about to head on a train to meet my dad because I am taking him out on a daddy and daughter date. Um, about this time last year, I went to saw Nick Cave uh, at the All Points East Festival. Dad didn't want to talk to me for two days because he was a little bit upset and jealous. So <laughs> Nick Cave is doing an in concert at the Barbican tonight. I got his tickets, so I'm taking him out as a late Father's Day and early birthday present. Yay. He's coming, but where's he coming from? That way? Or that way? Who knows? He's coming from the underground, so I'm assuming that way. There he is. Huh? Oh, yeah. Good, made it. Ah, uh, we've had a bit of a walking tour of London and have arrived at Arthur Street. Yay! Beer stop. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> early for your train, what else do you do other than get an impromptu haircut? Um, that's killed some time, I think I've still got about an hour and a half to go, so I'm gonna go buy some food, get a coffee, chill out for a little bit and, uh, and then get the train. And in a minute I'll tell you all about the concert. I have been here since 8.30, um, uh, did the haircut, uh, did three coffees, bought some food and now waiting. I've got a train at 11.30 so an hour and 15 minutes to wait um, and then a two hour train journey and then environmental health are coming in to view the new property and figure out if our plans are acceptable and if we need to do anything else and just to kind of make sure it's all good and, and yeah how they want it. Um, but Nick Cave last night was exceptional. Um, didn't film a great deal. Dad doesn't like being on camera. Um, so went to the pub with him, had some dinner, uh, and then went to the Barbican. And yeah, just amazing, amazing gig. Um, and it was a Q&A with the audience. So there were people standing up and asking different questions. Um, some of them natted on a bit longer than necessary, uh, but Nick Cave was very polite, answered them to the best of his ability and played some beautiful 
beautiful uh, songs on the piano. Um, completely different to the way I saw him last year, which was in concert with the Bad Seeds. This was much more intimate, much more involving as the audience, I think, in a completely different way to how a gig is. Um, but everyone thoroughly enjoyed it. Uh, I went back to Ollie's last night, uh, had a bit of a catch up with him, which was lovely. And then he went to work this morning and I came here super early. Um, so now I'm just bored and waiting. I've put a ask me anything thing out on Instagram. Don't know if anybody's gonna ask me anything, but yay, if they do, I'll, I'll put it on here. Yeah, just a waiting game now. I don't think I can have another coffee. Four before 10.30 is a bit too much, isn't it? Kill some time and listen to the buses. train um, oh, and there's air conditioning that's really cold. Um, uh, I meant to have reserved seats but this isn't the usual type of train so I guess just sit where you want and hope. Hopefully I'm on the right train. Uh, the sign above me said I was so fingers crossed. Um, it's weird there's no tables. This is like a what I would call a London commuting train not a like long journey passenger train. I don't know. Oh no. Um, no. I've got a table. I want a table. I also made a massive mistake in buying myself a very yummy looking salad and not picking up a fork. This is going to be messy. These are amazing. 